This is a quick look at Windows 11 virtual desktops. Most of the options are controlled with the task view button right here. These two windows that are overlaid on your taskbar. And you can create a new desktop by selecting new desktop, or you can press Windows Control D and it makes a new desktop and puts you in it at the same instance. Now I can rename this. So I could have a different desktop for every customer or every project. I can right click on each and choose a different background. Be aware if you select a color instead of a picture, it'll set all of your desktops to that color. I have seen some inconsistencies where the image selected for a background is not retained. Now I can hover over the task view window and I can drag and drop my desktops to rearrange them. You can right click on a desktop and select move right or move left. And you can close it or you can just X out. To switch from one desktop to another, just go to task view and select your desktop. You can also scroll to the right desktop. Right now I'm on desktop one. I can also press Windows Control right arrow and just scroll through and Windows Control left arrow and scroll back. Another thing I want to show you is applications are independent. You see how I'm at Google here and on a different desktop, I'm at the Intel site. If you need an app to be shared across all desktops, what you would do is click on the task view window, actually click it, not just hover, and then go to the desktop, right click on the app, and say, show this window on all desktops. Now, the calculator's on all desktops. And if I close it on one desktop, it's closed on all desktops. To move an application to a different desktop, again, click on the task view, go to the desktop on the app, right click and move and just select your desktop. See, I've moved the browser that's open to Google to my second desktop. So this is a quick overview. I hope this is helpful. Thank you.